to tonight's recap of Utopia. Woo, this is crazy. Last time it was pandemonium and they hugged it out. They hugged it out in the end. Now, Hello, day four. Day four, we've arrived. So they're like, we have all this money. What should we buy first? Should we buy a fridge? A computer? A water filter? She's like, uh, Bella's like, yeah, we got this thing called fluoride in the water, and I just, I need a water filter if I'm gonna be here. And Red and Dave are like, no, I will not use that. I don't want that. We so, want, we want our own whatever. Yeah, they want their cut yeah. of the money. Yeah, they don't want to drink no expensive water. They want to drink tap water. Yeah, so they decide they're gonna branch off a little bit and start their own state. The state of freedom. Utopia state of freedom. Well, Bella and Josh, all she's talking about is this damn chicken tractor. Yeah. One chicken can do the work of one man for a whole day. <sighs> Sorry. But they have to build it first. So in order to get the chickens to the chicken tractor, though, they have to make a chicken transporter. transporter. So it's like very a complicated. Cart. Yeah. It's kind of cute. Well, Dave and Red, they're looking for recruits. They want to sign some people up for the United State or Utopia State <laughs> Utopia freedom. State of Freedom. And they, uh, they're going around giving their political pitch. And no one's really interested at this point. Especially not Chris and Bree. The only thing they are interested in is Boom Chick Wow Wow. Chris is all like, so where are we going to beep? <laughs> He's looking for I a spot know. with no cameras. We'll see. I don't know. Can I just lick your neck a little? Ugh. All right. So Rob is totally freaking out. He's throwing stuff. He's yelling. And Red's like, you stupid little man. Yeah. And they start talking about height. And he's like, you look an inch taller. And then Red's like, what? I got like six inches on you. <laughs> they all start laughing. And that's the end of the fight. It was, it seems so scripted, but I guess it wasn't. So, in this new Utopia, clothing is optional. Well, That's fine by Josh. Some of the Utopians are loving it. Yeah. Some of them, not so much. Aaron's pretty uncomfortable. We already know that Jonathan doesn't like it. No, of course. But Aaron is also like... I can't deal with this. Can we, like, build a wall around all that? And Hex is all, like, making it about her. She's all like, well, now I'm embarrassed. How He's dare like, you make me feel embarrassed? I just don't want to see any TNA. Yeah, Put it really. away. We built the tarp around the shower. Yeah. So then she starts complaining. What was to it? Bree. To Bree. Oh, it's all because of organized religion. I just think it's, like, disrespectful. They know that people are uncomfortable. Why can't they just freaking wear a bathing suit or shower with the wall around it? All right. So Dave is having a little reflection on life. Yeah. He's talking about how um, he feels bad, that he's not really involved with his daughter. She's, like, nine years old now. He, he remembers back in the good old days when he was following a religion mm -hmm. that he got the best things in his life done. So he wants to go talk to John. And he's more than happy yeah. to read the Bible with him. So they do. It turns out pretty well. And that's... Is, is this a new... Could it be? ...thing? It might be. For Dave? Well, everyone's pretty hungry. Yeah, they haven't ordered groceries yet because they haven't been able to charge the phone. So they're, they said they're eating like less than a thousand calories a day at this point. So I, I think it was Dave who's like, hey, let's kill the cow and get some hamburgers up in here. And everyone's like, uh, no. <laughs> let's plant some seeds so we can eat in three months. Yeah, so Bella and the doctor <laughs> are working on getting this garden started, and she's trying to explain something to her. And then Dave comes over. He's like, can you explain it to me, too? And she, she's like, no. I'm I want to help plant the no. seeds. Let me see the damn seeds. I can read. I'm an adult. Let me see those seeds. Yeah, so he picks up the seeds, and she won't just let him read. I feel like at that point, you pick your battle. Yeah. She could have just let him read the packets, but she's like, no, put those seeds down. She's just as much of a maniac as he is. Oh, yeah, for sure. You know, they're pinning all this on him, but... Everybody else needs to just chill. Get a little leeway. Exactly. So he freaks out. He storms off. Yeah. 
Well, it seems like there are some other people who are not really agreeing with Bella's farming and animal yeah, care techniques. Yeah, Bree is a vet tech or a vet assistant, and she tells Bella, uh, honey, you are freaking out the chickens. Yeah, she said, chickens are creatures of habit, and you got them doing this yard work right now, and they're not yeah. used to it, so we could be out of eggs for a while. They're not going to want to lay their eggs if you change their environments. And uh, Bella is just like, I don't care. I want to get this thing going. I want to eat eggs for two weeks, if that's what it takes. <laughs> All right, well, there's some good news on Utopia. Josh finally fi finishes the trench and hooks up the electricity. So they have this big ceremony where they turn on the switch. Five, four, three, two, one. And it's lights. Like, no lights. Da! Lights. <laughs> <laughs> so the lights come on. It's amazing. They get to plug in their hair dryers and their clippers Woo! and all this stuff. I bet that made Mike happy with that oh, luscious hunk it. of hair that he's got. Yeah, and they were able to charge the phone. Yep, and now Dave sets up his prison barbershop. Yeah. All right, so how long before he starts giving out tattoos? Oh, stop. All right, so now that they have the phone ready to go, they're ready to buy some groceries. So Dave wants jail food because it's the most delicious food in all the world. <gasps> He's telling so all the good. girls, like, this is what I want, and they're like, you can't eat that. It's too metallic, whatever. And he's just like, I don't care. I want to eat this. <laughs> so all Bella can think about is her chicken tractor, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so Dave and Red, they're going to take matters into their own hands. They want their freaking cut of the money. They try to open the safe. They're unsuccessful at first. Bella, like, freaking creeps up behind them. And I'm waiting for her to be like, what are you what doing? Are you do? Yeah. But, but she's, she's like, Dave, can you come help me when you're done with this? <laughs> and he kind of just ignores her. Yeah. So she goes off into the corner to give herself a pep talk. And a nice hug. She's like, she's... you stay in there, baby. You just, you keep being you. And then <laughs> oh, she was like. Oh, my God. If only little Simba were here. Why would you want little Simba here? Well, she wants <laughs> little Simba to lick her face and kiss the tears off. <laughs> oh my god. I'm assuming little Simba's a dog. I I would think little Simba's a cat. Little Simba? Yeah, but Lion? Lucy looks like Simba sometimes. Yeah, I'm thinking it's a cat. She mm. seems too crazy for dogs. Well. Alright, so they're making the grocery order. Eight so Aaron is on the phone. They're on the phone. He's trying to get some prices for some of the food. And Dave is like, hey, hey, yeah, I want some ramen soup. I want my soups. I want my soups. They're like 30 for $2 and change. I've never seen them that cheap. That's but pretty cheap. That is really cheap. And Aaron's just like, yo, I'm on the phone. Mike is there. He's like writing down the prices and everything. They're just like, you need to chill. We're on the phone. Right. They thought he was ordering, but he was really only getting the prices. Mm -hmm. So... Red and Dave freak the freak out because they feel like they're not being heard. <sighs> they knock down the, ca the cans that they have in storage and they start freaking squashing the S out of them with their shoes. Doesn't it hurt? They're not wearing, and like, how do they do it? boots either. They're wearing sneakers. Yeah, well, Dave was really pissed in particular about, I think, uh, Aaron was trying to get, like, Keep radish. Off. Yeah. Radishes. Yeah. And he was like, who wants that freaking horseradish, <laughs> that pickled horseradish? I don't want that. <laughs> who can live on that? Yeah, so let's get back to Josh and Bella. Oh, boy. She wants him, and he wants to make her chick shaw. I'm telling you, these two are going to get together at, at some point. In a big way. They're going to be... Uh, it's going to happen. The president and the first lady of <laughs> Utopia. Okay. All right, so the groceries arrive. Yay! Yay! So they get all the food, and Dave and Red pissed again. They got their freaking ramen, and they're still pissed. They're like, why are you spending all this money on rice, brown rice? That's $20, and... Look at all this white rice for just, like, six dollars. Yeah. He's also upset about the <laughs> queen... Wait, how did he say it? <laughs> Queenoa. Yeah. <laughs> it's quinoa, Dave. You'll like it. It's uh, good. Quinoa. All, all right. right. Chris and Brie. Yes. Ridiculous. She <gasps> is, like, in all middle over school. Him. She's in middle school. I, I, She's, like, rubbing a lime all over him and then, like, eating the lime. Licking it and, off and... 
It's really weird. You know, these two are ridiculous because she's extremely immature and she just wants attention from him. Yeah. And he just wants sex from and anyone. She also wants attention, I think, from America because she's like, what do you think people are saying about us? What do you think uh, our couple name is? Well, I got news for you. It's Briss. Ugh. <laughs> yeah. All right. So Red and Dave... They, they finally go back to crack the safe. into that safe. They take out their share of the money, which is now down to four hundred something dollars. That seems high. I don't know that well, that's right. When they were saying, well, when they were saying nine hundred, was that for both of them before? I guess. All right. Yeah, it does seem kind of high, doesn't it? Yeah. So they use the telephone and they order up their own groceries, like a hundred fifty dollars worth of stuff. These fools are buying freaking Oreos, chips. No, the most ridiculous thing was bologna, bologna, and hamburgers. You don't have a refrigerator. I don't think they got the refrigerator. No, yet. I don't think so. Where are you putting all that perishable food? The mayo. Once you crack that bad boy open, it's gonna be. Maybe they're eating that in one sitting. Spoil. <laughs> well, they decide to have a barbecue. This is their opportunity to bribe people with food and get them to join the Utopia State junk food of Freedom barbecue or whatever. Party. Yeah. And everybody shows up except for Bella and Joshy. Josh. I don't think they were the only ones. Well, everybody, a lot of people were sniffing around for those everybody's burgers. Everybody's like, "Yeah, can I have some chips on can my I burgers?" Put a chip on my burger. <laughs> Was that Mike? I don't know. <laughs> or no, that might have been Chris. All right. So, what do you do after you eat? You got to do the deed. Let's go up to the hayloft. There's Chris no cameras up there. Uh, yeah, there's a camera right there, and I'm sure they caught all of that. Thankfully, they cut it off. Oh, they did, and they described it on the website as well. No! <laughs> they did it. They did it. They did it. All right, well, next time, <laughs> Utopia Babe. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> we might be. Next time, two new people will be arriving. And one will join in. Red, not red, Dave also gets baptized in the next episode, and somebody gets kicked out. Oh, all right. So, come along with us on this crazy utopia. Till next time, much, much love. love. Edit. Hey, 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 hey.